What I'm about to share may upset some of you, especially if you have children. But do you recall this article I posted on my home school Spurs page back in November of last year? No, you're not hallucinating if you haven't seen it. That's actually a homosexual man dressed as a woman who appears to be possessed by a demon who likes to sport five horns. And he is literally reading an LGBT story to precious little children in, get this, the Michelle Obama Public Library in Long Beach, California. As expected, some of the children were very happy and entertained by all this. But then this is to be expected if you have ever watched modern day cartoons or read a comic book or even seen a DC movie lately, wherein all sorts of demons are appearing to look like heroes or even cute. Also, as expected, some of the children have been adversely affected. And yes, as per biblical jurisprudence, some of them have been possessed by the demons their very own parents allowed them to play with because they have allowed Satan permission to be in their homes. And now, because of all this, we see boys as young as 10 years old not only dressing as drag queens, they're actually starting drag clubs for kids. But it gets worse. Check this article out that I just ran across as I was getting ready to record the audio for this video. A nine-year-old boy is now considered the cover girl for an erotic homosexual clothing store. And so you have to ask, why do homosexuals keep claiming that homosexuality and pedophilia are two different lifestyles or demons, for that matter? I mean, anyone with eyes can see. This is an adult erotic clothing store for homosexuals, and they have a nine-year-old boy dressed up as a drag queen and is being considered as their cover girl. You know, in any event, it's all happening like this because Jesus prophesied this is what's going to happen. He said it would be as it was in Noah's day, right before the flood that killed them all for legalizing homosexuality and all the insane lifestyles that go with it. This is why you see all the homosexuals sporting rainbows. They themselves have no clues to why they're doing that. They're just doing it. They think it's their flag, but the demons in them know exactly why Jesus put that rainbow in the clouds after the flood. And so we have to expect stuff like this to be happening on a regular basis because these are the last days. And right before Jesus gets here, this is what it's going to be like. And so please pray for these manipulated children and their sin-sick parents. Also pray for all those parents out there that see what you and I see, but are having a hard time getting their precious children out of the American school system, wherein all the children are now being preyed upon as playthings by the United States government, because they're the ones that are funding all of it to make sure it cultivates within the children a mindset that when they are old enough to vote, all of this will be normalized. Thank you for watching. God bless.